Good evening. We have gotten a ton of comments on a story we did last night about a dog taken from outside a restaurant in New Caney. We found the dog and reunited the Golden Retriever with her family. The case still under investigation by the Montgomery County Sheriff's Office, but we wanted to know if Lucy was taken or rescued. Matt Doherty spoke with the family that took the dog. He joins us live with a follow up to a story you'll only see on KHU 11. Matt. Yeah, Lynn, this story may not be exactly what it appears. There are two kids involved and they're telling me that they meant no harm. And tonight they're saying that they are both sorry. Last night we introduced you to Lucy, the golden retriever. <laughs> we showed you the joy and laughter she brings to her family in North Texas. And we also showed you this surveillance video from Sunday afternoon outside of the Gringo's restaurant in New Caney when Lucy was untied from a tree and taken. We tracked down the owner of the truck. Hello. Found the home and walked away with Lucy. Come on, baby. It was a happy reunion. Oh, yes, it's you. <laughs> Today, we went back to that home with all the dogs to find out what they could have been thinking the day they said they took Lucy. We weren't expecting this. She was looking confused. It's cause she was like with her mouth open, but she, like a lot of saliva coming out of her mouth. We thought, oh, she's super thirsty. We've blurred the faces of this 13 year old boy and his 12 year old sister. They aren't charged with any crimes, but they were in the truck when Lucy was taken. They were with their mom at the time, who told us off camera that her kids encouraged her to take the dog home. We were thinking that they probably just left it there for like an hour or two, or they abandoned it so we didn't know. So we had to take a choice and just took it because we thought it was abandoned. Lucy's owner says he did tie the dog to a tree in the shade and left her a bowl of water while he and his family were inside eating. He says it was still early in the day and not too hot. He didn't think anything about it. When he walked outside, Lucy was nowhere to be found. Tonight, two kids and their mom are asking for the owner's pardon. They say it was all just a very big mistake. We're so sorry if you thought we stole it. We, weren't, we didn't do it for bad uh, intentions. We did it for a good cause because we thought it was abandoned. Now, I reached out to the owner earlier tonight. He said he was not able to speak with us about all of these new developments. Lynn, back to you. All right, Matt, thanks for the update.